guys good morning from madrid it's currently 1 15 in madrid right now it's one hour ahead from the uk we arrived yesterday and today here we are to madrid um behind me is a bullfight arena and we're heading to the royal palace of madrid i'm gonna take the train it's currently the weather is around 30 degrees right now it's really hot but the wind is really nice and cooling so so I hope you enjoy the vlog. Again, I shouldn't be sleeping away. It's still right now, and I'm stuck in my bed. Still right now, and I'm stuck in my head. Cause I've been just not all on my own. We made it to the Royal Palace of Madrid. It's so hot right now. We're like contemplating whether to go across. I actually been here uh, back in 2019 with my friends. Um, shout out to Zoriana Lewis. Yes, we've been here, and it was around September time, and it was actually similar weather. And I still remember it the way I remember it. Stretch, brush my hair, always looking like a mess. Only me at the go and do the press. So guys, we took the train here. We took the metro, and we availed a three-day tourist ticket. And it costs around for three days it costs around 18 40 euros so we have a travel card and that you can travel in the zone one i like how the weather is hot but there's also wind so it's not bad i got a drink before i get dehydrated here but you know what i'm not gonna complain because it's not always hot it's always either raining or blue in the uk it's currently in the UK right now. Say hi. 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 I'm here in Madrid. Madrid. Hello. I thought I could only reach Madrid in reading the book. But at the moment, we are already here. At the back is the Royal Palace. Madrid Royal Palace. And this one is the Cathedral. So, Cathedral in Madrid. With you, I never feel alone. These little songs make me glad to. So, guys, we just finished having our Turkish, Turkish food, which is basically some kebab. And now we're heading to um, Retero, which is um, car, car park, which is one of the park bar. Uh, we're gonna go to the pa Crystal Palace and the monument there. I forgot what it's called. But there's like a little lake there as well. I'll be heading there. a bit from the uh, main area and then we got to the crystal palace i think it was just maybe a five minute walk so we got here it's basically like a glass kind of building and it's free as well Ritero and behind me is one of the monuments and there's a lake you can actually go on a boat there I think it's around no don't call me this was like two years ago it's like six euros or something I mean, it's so hot right now it's around nearly seven o'clock 7 p.m so guys we just had some ice cream and just some water because it is so hot and we've been walking around like mostly of mostly all of all day today so it's just tiring so it's just nice to just
actually last time we arrived on the other side this time we arrived the other side which is the town and I didn't realize it existed Whoa. it's so hot in my dress right now so this is my dress and it's so hot in wearing it look at them too wearing the same outfit because it's their anniversary today I'm tired already and I didn't even walk that far. Look at it. I'm tired. My own way. Yeah, things don't change. I've gotta do better than you for me. You're all about you. All of the things that you do. You're all about you. All in all. Hamon and ham and cheese. No, if, it's, if this is in England, this is great. Yeah. Nami lang. Wey lain? Mister Ramanto, napa may lain pero wong kabal on sekuan. I don't know the other flavor. So guys, we walked a little bit more, and we got to the. I don't even know this name. Hold on. Let me, let me look this up. The Alcazar. The Segovia. It's a Roman medieval castle restored after fire. Uh, why is it in Spanish? <laughs> Basically, it's a museum. It's in Spanish, unfortunately, in Google. Look at that view. Guys, do you see that view from the back? It's like a deserted place. last day of touring around Madrid yesterday we went to Segovia we came home around 8 o'clock and now we're on our way to Sol which is one of the main attractions in Madrid I haven't taken my parents there and then afterwards we'll probably go to Gran Via Gallery something like that it's like a shopping area and then we'll see from then on Curly it is nice and sunny. It's around 38 degrees. Oh, it's so hot. So we got a apple pie. How does it? What does it taste like? It's all right. Then I got a Long Island iced tea, and my mom got a melon drink, and there's an Oreo cake as well. So we stopped by at this little cafe. Well, not so little, but it's a cafe on the side near the Grand Via. Grand Via is just over there. You can't really see it. But we just stopped over because we saw these fans. We saw these fans because it was so hot. We wanted to just sit down for a bit. So I ordered a Long Island iced tea. I'm not really a fan of it. It just cost me 10 euros. Yeah, it's like a mold. 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 And we're currently in the middle of the road. It's really hot. It's, it's around like 37 degrees right now. And we're on our way to get some dinner. It's actually 6 o'clock right now and look at the weather still. Construction, there's a lot of things going on, so there's not much, it's not a lot of places you can take pictures of, but this area is really nice. Yeah. 
Like the building is so nice. Like if you can see the background. traveling for like nearly half an hour on the bus we got to the Jose Rizal monument it's gone dark now because it's around 10 o'clock in the night time this is a replica or a similar monument to what we have in Luneta in the Philippines in Manila I actually don't know much about Jose Rizal because I didn't, I didn't go to school in the Philippines